but ah, you don't get it. But I've been afraid of my father my whole life. I spent every waking moment just trying to stop him from exploding. Just trying to do everything right. And not just believing, but knowing that one day he'd kill me. He'd kill us all. You know, my first memory is of the day that my brother spilled a can of paint down the stairs. My parents were painting the house and Ricky thought he was helping. But it was too heavy for him and the paint just went flying everywhere. So I held my breath. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that would help. My father put his fist straight through the wall. I screamed and Ricky and I started crying and the whole time that he... The whole time he just kept yelling at us to stop crying. I couldn't... I thought he was going to kill us both. And my mother couldn't stop him. I was four years old. Ricky was two. And I've been living in that hole in the wall ever since. So I can't forgive him. And I won't pretend. So go read Footprints in the Sand if it will make you feel warm and fuzzy inside. Today my father goes into the ground. Except I don't remember having a father. Because a father couldn't do that to his kids. <laughs>